Okay, so making adjustments to the older model of the Wiesmann boiler um, with the old style controller. We want to adjust heating curves and times. Heating curves are available in level one by pressing the first two buttons, the standby button, hot water button, and it will come up with the menu on here. The flashing digits are changed with the plus or minus button. So if we go down, we're looking for adjusting the slope, D3. I've adjusted this earlier to 1.4. It doesn't show the point, but 14 is 1.4. And that's the default setting that the Wiesmann boiler comes at. And it's usually a good setting for most properties. If you've got the boiler set at a specific temperature and the rooms aren't reaching that temperature, it suggests that the curve is low and you need to raise it. If you've got it set at a specific temperature and the rooms are running at a lower temperature, sorry, at a higher temperature, it suggests the curve is too high and you need to lower it. If you want to lower it, if you select it by pressing OK, the value that you're going to change will flash. And we can raise it with the plus button or reduce it with the minus button. OK will register it. You'll see it come up as accepted. The display will change. So we could change this if you wanted to go and alter some other codings. And to leave the setup, we press the same two buttons. So that's adjusting the curve, mm -hmm. okay, and the reasons for adjusting it. To set the programming, you have the buttons here. This is heating timing, hot water timing, and there are other functions here. A good function here is the hot water function. On a boiler with a cylinder for a Wiesmann should be set to 50. Let's go back. So we'll just change that. And we can set up a, a weekly program to raise the temperature um, to sterilize the cylinder unit, uh, which I'll set up later. So that's set for general purpose for 50. Okay, so timing for central heating. This is seven days. Heating time one. It's coming on at 6. We've already decided together we'd do this at 5.30 in the morning. Press OK. And we wanted it off at 11. And press OK. And that's the time's done. That's the same every day. It's going to come on at 5.30 in the morning. And it'll run at whatever temperature we select on the dial. So let's go out of there. Just press OK. daytime temperature set here so I think we'd agree 21 so now if we've got the curve right the house should be running at 21 degrees between 5:30 and 11 o'clock at night and then we've got the reduced room temperature which is this one here the moon and the thermometer sets your reduced room temperature it's currently set at 13 Let's set this up to 18 press OK so now during the off times, night time, the radiator temperatures will drop and they'll be targeting to maintain the temperature of the house at 18 degrees during the night time. And obviously the lower the temperature, the less gas consumption you've got. But by running on any of those curves, you're running the most efficient way to run the boiler at any time. So that's it, that's curves and um, times.